Hey, it's Annie. Today I am going to talk about the Sephora sale that starts this Friday, I believe. Um, I just got my little thing in the mail, so I'm like, and I know a couple of you have asked me to do a video, so I'm just, I'm not doing a lot of shopping at this. I'm just going to be honest with you. I'm not doing a lot of shopping on at this sale because I've already shared that We've, we're buying furniture right now. I have to buy clothes for myself. I need shirts. You probably are gonna get sick of seeing me wear the same stuff over and over again, but you're going to for a while. You're gonna see me wear the same clothes, sorry. Um, so I'm only um, getting what I really, really need. That's what I'm getting at the sale. So that is what I'm gonna talk about. I'm gonna talk about things that I'm gonna replenish. And then I'm gonna talk about things that I don't need to replenish, but I definitely would recommend. So that is what I'm going to talk about. And these are just really, really good things. This isn't just like whatever, you know what I mean? So it's all good stuff. So let's see, is this, I just got this in the mail and it should say, does it give me all the deets on it? Let's see if this gives me all the details. Let me get my glasses on and we will do this. All right. So the beauty insider appreciation event starts Friday, August 24th to Monday, September 3rd. Um, if you're a rouge, which I'm a rouge and I had no idea I was a rouge. I didn't think I spent that much money this year, but I guess I did. <laughs> um, so if you are a rouge, you get 20% off of everything. And that starts on the 24th, this Friday. And you use the code YESRUGE. And it says it's a one-time use. So you, can only, so you can't go back and keep it's like you have to just use it once. You can't change your mind and go, oh, I want to get that. Mm -mm. I guess that's, I don't know if they've always done it that way, but that's how it is this time. Um, and then on the uh, on August 30th to September 3rd, the VIB and Insiders can shop. Um, the VIBs get 15% off, the Insiders get 10% off. And again, I believe it's a one okay so here's the deal okay so it's one time use i guess if you go to use this online it's a one time it says in store you can present this card in unlimited okay so if you go if i go and bring my card to the store i can i can go ahead and do it as many times as i want but if you do it online you can only do it once so if you get one of these cards in the mail it'll explain it so but the code that i'm going to give you you can only use it once and I will put all the details below with the information on the sale, the code, and then we're just gonna get right into this. Uh, really quickly, make sure you click that button below, hit the subscribe button, I share new videos every single week, don't want you to miss out, and click on the notification bell, because anytime we share a new video, you'll be notified. I know I'm saying that really, really fast, but I sound like a robot sometimes, but if I don't say it, then yeah, you know how it goes. If you did not pick up the Beauty Blender, and I really, really hope that you did, <laughs> Please make sure you pick up the Beauty Blender. I love these. Don't judge me by mine. I clean these every single time before I use them. I just did my makeup, so I have Iggy's on it. But um, these will last me if you take really good care of them. They last me a year, but don't tell anybody I told you that. <laughs> they do. They, they recommend that you change it more often, but I really take good care of them and I clean mine. And I have not had any weird skin things happen to me. I'm not telling you to do that. I'm just telling you that's what I do. So I make sure that I pick them up when they are on sale. And the one that I'm going to link is you get two of them, plus you get a cleanser, which I think is a really, really good deal. Now, I love that liquid cleanser. And you, like I said, if you're going to get it, get it in a bundle like that because you're going to save money as opposed to just getting one. Um, but another cleanser that I love and would highly recommend this, I purchased this one, I think it was after Christmas. So it's summer, January, February, March, April, May, June, July, August. So it's eight months now and I still have plenty left. So it comes like this in this black container. I'm gonna show you mine, it looks gross. And there it is, I still have a lot. There's a still a lot left in there, but I'm gonna pick up another one of these. Uh, I'm not gonna get Beauty Blender because I just got some at the Nordstrom sale but I'm definitely going to pick one of these up. This is wonderful. I not only use this to clean my beauty blender, but I clean my brushes. Now, normally you're able to take this out. I can't take it out anymore because I was like really cleaning it now and it's getting towards the end. Um, but I love 
this. I really do love it. It's, I mean, I still have, I bet it will last me, it might even last me till December, I don't know, but since it's on sale, I wanna pick up another one. So I definitely would highly recommend it. Does a great job cleaning my beauty blender. Does a great job cleaning my brushes. That's that's what I use to clean my brushes. I love it. This is one thing that I'm not saying go run out and get it, but if you're thinking about getting it, this is the time to do it. And that's with anything. I mean, if there's any foundations you're thinking of trying or powders, or whatever, eye palettes, whatever, like this is the time to get it because you're gonna get a discount with it. So, you know, you, this stuff isn't like it goes on sale all the time. So this is the time to stock up or to try new things. So one of the things I bought at the last sale, and I don't remember when it was, because I don't think I bought anything at the, the last sale because we were moving. So would this have been from last summer? I've said that like summer or was, did, was there a sale over? I can't remember when I bought this, but I bought a set of the uh, Sol de Janeiro Bomb Bomb Cream. So mine came with the cream. It came with the spotty spray and I have the balm and I don't have it in front of me. Now they do have a set now that's this and this. And I haven't used much of this and I have not used this yet. The reason is, is because I'm still using up some other body creams and my cashmere line that I shared my empties on, I still have some some of that that I just want to use up and be done with. Ooh, be done with. I thought I would have been done with it by now and I'm not. Um, as soon as I am, I'm gonna break into this. This is expensive. Um, they claim that it's supposed to lift. It doesn't lift. It doesn't. I enjoy the scent. Now, I know some people don't like the scent. So if you're not sure if you're gonna like this, I would say go to the store and check it out first. I really do like this. It's not something you have to have. It's just a really nice body cream. It feels nice on me. I love the scent of it. Um, that's what sells me on it. It's not the lifting or anything like that, but it is expensive. So. Oh the hell out of me. Somebody is, <laughs> I may have to take a break here. We're having our house spread for insects and I didn't know what in the hell that was. I thought there was a bird that was trying to get in here because we've had that happen before. I just started using this, um, how many months now have I been using this? Several months, several months I started using the Bobbi Brown um, under eye cream. It's ridiculously overpriced, but I had been trying some different things and nothing was working. And I'm really careful about eye creams that I use because I don't want to get anything that I get little milias because I do get those on my skin. This has not caused it. A little bit goes a long way. I still have plenty left in here. It looks like I do. I just, I use very little. Um, it'll be interesting to see how long this one lasts me. I don't know that I'm going to get this one at the sale because I do have some left and I'm hoping it's going to last long, I'm hoping. But if you're thinking about trying it, I would I would recommend trying it. If, if you're looking for a good eye cream, I would recommend this and get it on sale because I did not get mine on sale. So like I said, every little bit helps. If you're a Rouge member like me, it's really nice because you get 20% off, which is really, really good. So this one is the Ector. She has a couple of them and the one that I have is the extra eye cream, repair eye cream from Bobbi Brown. I really love it. Like I said, I just use very, very little under my eyes. And I am not a big believer in eye creams all the time, um, but I just have had a little bit of extra dryness underneath there and just a regular cream wasn't working for me. So that's why I splurged on this. I know, I know you guys, I know. Something that I love and I actually just bought this and I wish I would have waited. I did not get mine on sale because I have another one ready to go. Is the Fresh Soy Cleanser. I love this, this is for all skin types. It has amino acids in it. I use it in the morning, use very little. It smells so refreshing. It smells like cucumber. You just use a little bit. You massage it on your face. It turns into a cream so it doesn't, it's not drying, it doesn't suds or anything like that. Then I hit it up with my Clear Sonic and then I rinse it off love it would highly highly recommend it it's been a repurchase for me many times um just as that's been a repurchase too even though it's a splurge something i love but i'm going to um advise you on this a little bit okay so i purchased the clarisonic uplift i'm looking for my other attachment last 
was it last year? I don't remember when I bought this. I'm trying to remember if I bought this at the sale or not either. Um, I've been using a Clarisonic for many years. I was using it, then I stopped using it because I thought maybe it's making my face break up more. I don't know. And then I started using it again. And when I started using it again, I decided to give my daughter my old one, which she is still using. So it's still going strong. And that's probably uh, maybe five years old already. I don't even know. Uh, we've had it for a long time, much longer than they say it's supposed to last. Um, so I decided to get the uplift and it comes with this attachment. I really did not see any results using this at all. It's kind of a massaging thing that you do. I didn't find that it did anything for me, so I would not recommend the Uplift. If you're gonna get a Clarisonic, I would just get the regular Clarisonic, in my opinion. So if you're gonna get one, I would just get a Mia. It'll cleanse your skin. If you wanna use that um, makeup brush, which is amazing, I just haven't been using it because of my my continually dry patchy skin that I deal with because of my retin-a your skin's always turning over and I just feel like if I use I mean I do use this to cleanse it with but then I feel like if I'm using that makeup brush to apply my makeup I just feel like it's kicking up too much and peeling and that you know what I'm saying like I, I just can't use that anymore I don't use brushes I just use my beauty blender it just works best for me but I really do recommend the Clarisonic one of the um foundations that I love is from Shishido. Well, I call it a I call it a foundation, even though it's a BB cream. It's a Shishido Sports. It has 50 SPF in it. I love it. Now, do not ever just depend on this as your SPF. This is kind of like when when I use a foundation or a BB cream or a CC cream or whatever that has an SPF in it. I just feel like that's like a little extra. But you always want to make sure you put uh, SPF on your face first and then you can use this. So I feel like it's a little extra. So when I'm gonna be out in the sun a lot, this is what I like to wear if I'm gonna be out all day, because I just feel like I'm getting that extra, plus I have a powder that I can put on, so I really try to protect my face. So I definitely would recommend it. The downsides to this, they don't have a really big color selection, so that's something I don't like, but I really do like the product, I really, really do. This is something that's non-negotiable. I have repurchased this many times. And it is my Sunday Riley Good Jeans. This has a lactic acid in it. I know some people say they don't like the scent, and I'm gonna be honest with you, I don't like it either, but at least it's not a perfume scent. It's the scent that it is is from the ingredients that are in it. I believe it's the lemongrass that get, gives off like a weird smell, but it's nothing that lasts. I just use a half a pump and I dot it on my chin, my cheeks, my nose, my forehead, and then I massage it in. And it just helps keep my skin, um, like anything that, that my Retin-A is kicking up and I'm getting that dry skin because it's exfoliating, this goes back in and kind of gets some of that, sloughs some of that off. That's why I use acids. You don't use it at the same time as your Retin-A, okay? But I use it in conjunction with it. So if I use my Retin-A at night, then I use this in the morning. I love it, would highly recommend it. If you're gonna get it, I would recommend getting the bigger one. I love the Lancome Bifacial. I always like to get it on sale if I can. This is a great time to stock up on it. I use waterproof mascara, so it's really hard to take off. If you don't use waterproof mascara, then, you know, but for me, I just, I love it. I just feel like it gets all my eye makeup off, my brow makeup off my mascara off and I'm not like tugging and I try to be really careful with my eyes. I really love this, would highly recommend it. This is something that I recently purchased and I love. It, it is the Anastasia Brow Stencils. I love it. It makes doing my brows so much easier, so much quicker. You get five stencils in here and there's all different shapes and you just match it up to your that's the rock size, but you just match it up there. And with these, you can adjust them. I know had somebody said that they had maybe tried it, but it was too big or something, but you can adjust it. So if you're getting where it looks like your tail's gonna be down there, you just wanna slightly move it over and work it in and then, and then apply your um, powder or your pencil. I usually do a powder right now, and then I do, then I go and fill it in with a pencil, and then I use my clear uh, Anastasia gel would highly recommend it. This is what I've been doing with my brows and it's so much easier. Something that I love, and this has been a repurchase for me, I tried drugstore, I do like them, but I always come back to these. And I am like scraping it. I can see, it, the, it looks like the whole 
tube is filled up it isn't because i'm scraping it and are these two different ones because i have a couple here um yep they are so these are really similar this is more of a pink color this is more of a beige color these are the mark jacobs enamor i love these i love these i love these i love these i've been using these for several years now um they should be in my empties videos and I always forget about them because I mean I am scraping them out even though it looks like it, they're full they're not they are empty but they last me about I would say I get a year's use out of this so keep that in mind I think that is it that is it guys thank you so much for joining me I really I'm gonna make sure I don't have anything in my teeth <laughs> I really hope that you enjoyed this video I really hope that it was helpful and informative please make sure you give it a thumbs up subscribe share my videos helps my channel so much and i really really appreciate it i will leave all the information below too with the dates the codes all the good stuff i'll leave it all down below so and let me know in the comments what you're planning on getting at the sale as well so and that is it thank you so much and i will see you guys real soon